travel back in time over 250 million years to a world you wouldn't recognize. This was the Mesozoic era, an age ruled by magnificent and terrifying creatures. Our journey begins in the Triassic period, on the supercontinent of Pangaea. Life was recovering from a mass extinction and the first dinosaurs were appearing. They were small, nimble and built for survival in a harsh new world. As we move into the Jurassic period, the world grew wetter and more lush. This was the age of giants. The earth trembled under the feet of the sauropods. Herds of Brachiosaurus, with necks as tall as buildings, stripped leaves from the tallest trees. These gentle giants moved in massive herds across the vast Jurassic Plains. But where there is prey, there are always predators. The Allosaurus, a fearsome carnivore, was the terror of the Jurassic. It hunted in packs capable of taking down dinosaurs many times its size. Yet, defense evolved in incredible ways. Meet the Stegosaurus. Its iconic plates likely helped regulate body temperature and its tail was a lethal weapon. The Jurassic Seas were just as dangerous, ruled by marine reptiles like the Leopleurodon, now we enter the Cretaceous, the final and most famous chapter for the dinosaurs. Diversity exploded. The continents had drifted apart, creating unique new species. And here we meet the king. Tyrannosaurus rex, the tyrant lizard king, was the ultimate apex predator. With a bite force that could crush bone, Few creatures dared to challenge it, but some did. The Triceratops was a formidable opponent. A walking fortress, its horns and shield were designed for defense. Armor reached its peak with the Ankylosaurus, a living tank. Its body was covered in osteoderms and its tail ended in a massive bony club. Not all dinosaurs were giants. The Velociraptor was a small, intelligent hunter. Hunting in packs, they used their sharp claws with deadly precision. Meanwhile, the skies were dominated by the pterosaurs. These were not dinosaurs, but flying reptiles, some as large as a small aeroplane. For 150 million years, these incredible animals dominated the planet. Their reign seemed eternal, their power absolute. But it was not to last. From the depths of space, a catastrophe was approaching. An asteroid, the size of a mountain, set on a collision course with Earth. It, it struck the Yucatan Peninsula with the force of billions of atomic bombs. The impact triggered global earthquakes, volcanic eruptions and mega tsunamis. A cloud of superheated dust and ash enveloped the planet, blocking out the sun. Temperatures plummeted, photosynthesis stopped, the food chain collapsed. The age of the dinosaurs was over. A world of giants fell silent. 75% of all life on Earth was wiped out. But extinction makes way for new life. The small survived. This event paved the way for the rise of mammals and eventually for us. The dinosaur's legacy is not entirely gone. It's buried beneath our feet and it lives on in their only surviving descendants. Every bird you see today is a living dinosaur. From the terrifying T-Rex to the humble pigeon 
the connection is unbroken. They were a testament to life's power to adapt and dominate, a reminder of how different our world once was. Their story is a chapter in Earth's grand history, a story written in stone and bone, a reign of giants that will never be forgotten. Their world is gone, but their legacy endures.